Hello, today I am going to discuss some important questions which will be come in JK, Math and other computer exams part 2. If you, if you like my videos then kindly like, share and subscribe my channel. This is my YouTube channel link. Now, I describe the probabilities. Second part, this is the question. In how many ways can a committee of 5 teachers and 4 students be chosen? from 9 teachers and 15 students. Since there are 9 teachers, from 9 teachers we choose 5 teachers and from 15 students we choose 54 students. So there are number of options becomes the teacher can be selected as C9,5 and students can be selected as C15,4. So total number of ways becomes C9,5 into C15,4. Now in second portion, in how many ways can be committed to form if teacher A refuse to serve since there is a teacher he refused to serve, we become uh, eight teachers and if student be on the committee, so we get one more one less per student that is 14 students. So we become C9,5 into C15,4 minus C8,4 into C14,3. Here value of 8 means one teacher is refused and 14 means one student becomes subtracted. Next question, there are 21 consonants, 5 vowels in the English alphabet. Consider only 8 letter words with 3 different vowels and 5 different consonants. Since we have mentioned 5 different consonants and 3 different vowels, since from 21 consonants we get 5 different consonants, so C20,5, 21,5, and from 5 vowels we get only 3 vowels, so become C5,3. And since there are eight letter words, so we get eight factorial. So how many such words can be formed? The answer becomes C5,3 into C21,5 comma dot eight factorial. Choose vowels consonant, then arrange the eight letters. Next question: How many such words contains the letter A? Their vowels become fixed, so their vowels already defined. We can subtract it four vowels and two vowels since A is already fixed. So we can create it C4,2 and but consonant is not fixed, consonant becomes 5 and 21. So C21,5 but letter is A. So letter A is 8 factorial. This is the options. Next, how many contains the letter A and B? Here one vowel is fixed and one consonant is fixed. So one consonant fixed and one vowel means one vowel. So it is 2 and 4, C4,2. And one consonant fixed means it is 20 and it is 4. So it gets C21,4, but later it becomes 8, so it factor. Now, next question is how many contains the letter B share? Two consonants becomes B as C, but not mentioned vowels. So vowel says in previous question it becomes C5,3, but there are two vowels from that is 20 to 19 options. So C19,3. Two vowels means two already subtracted, so C19,3 and 8 factorial cells. Next question How many contains the letter A, B, C? Here A is one vowel and B, C, two consonants, so becomes answer C4,2 into show 19,8 into 8 factorial. Next question How many begins with letter A and with B? So letter A is mentioned vowels and B is consonant, so it is the same question C4,2 into C21,4 since letter is fixed uh, which is start with A end with B so two, two letters are fixed and remaining are arranging in their ways so there is so six factorials next question how many begins with letter B end with C since uh, end of the letter is C fixed and begins B is fixed they both are consonant so number of words becomes six factorials and consonant becomes P, B and C, so option 19,3, but while is C, 15,3. So answer becomes C, 5,3 into C, 19,3 into 6 factorials. Next question. There are 30 females, 35 males in the junior class, while there are 25 females, 20 males in the senior class. In how many ways can a committee of can be chosen so that there are exactly five females and three juniors of the committee. Since exactly five females and three juniors, that means
So from seniors we get only five females and from seniors we get two juniors. So total number of person is 10. We can select is 0, 3, 5, 2. From juniors, junior we get only three, three juniors in the committee and 10 we choose and there are exactly five females. Five is fixed. Female number is fixed. So male is two. Again, this becomes juniors from two on that is three is juniors. And remaining portion is seven. From seven we get these options. Exactly five means five. Maximum value of five that is five, four, three, two. There is no option. So one plus two plus four, uh, seven. And remaining portion is three. Proceeding in this way, we get these tables and we write it C30, comma zero. C thirty five comma three, C twenty five comma five, C twenty plus uh, twenty comma two plus C one uh, thirty comma one, C thirty five comma two, C twenty five comma four, C twenty comma three plus C thirty comma two, C thirty five comma one, C twenty five comma three, C four twenty comma four plus C thirty comma three, C thirty five comma zero, C twenty five comma two. C 20,5 there is the option it becomes is given so from these options we write this for equations and if we solve this we get this answer next there is the one theorem theorem uh, enumerating r permutations with n unlimited repetition formula becomes u n r equal to n to the power r. this is the important formula next questions there are 25 true false questions on an examination how many different ways can be student do the examinations if he she can also choose to leave the answer blank? So there are three options that is true false and he cannot be uh, answered the question. So three are options. So it is becomes T to the power 25. Next question. The, ex the result of 50 football games that is win, loss or tie are to be predicted. How many different forecasts can contain easily 28 correct results? So there are three options, win, loss, or tie. So choose 28 correct results. See 50, 28 ways. Each of the remaining 22 games has two wrong forecasts. Thus there are C, 50, 28 into 22 forecast with exactly 28 correct predictions. Next, there is another theorem. Enumerating R combinations with unlimited repetitions, that is, the number of R combinations of N distinct object with unlimited repetitions becomes C N minus R, C N minus 1 plus R, comma. Next question, the number of four combinations of A1, A2, A3, A4, A5 is four combinations and five value of A. So we write this using this formula, we write it as C5, comma 1 plus 4 comma 4. Since 4 is 4 combination that is the value of r equal to 4 and a1, a2, a3, a5 means n equal to 5. So answer becomes c5 comma 1 plus 4 comma 4. Next question how many different outcomes are possible by tossing 10 similar coins c2 comma 1 plus 10 comma 10. There are 10 possible so 10 similar coins but 2 possible outcomes. So c2 comma 2 minus 1 plus 10 plus 10. Using this formula, we can solve multiple questions. How many different outcomes are possible from tossing 10 similar ties? That is C, 6, 1 plus 10 plus 10. There are say, 10 similar ties, but uh, from ties we get possible uh, 6 outcomes. So we write 6, 1 plus 10, 10. Next question. How many ways can 20 similar groups are placed on 5 different cells? Since cell size are fixed, but 20 books are shuffled between them, so answer becomes C 5, 1 plus 20, 20. Next question Enumerating the number of ways of placing 20 indistinguishable balls into 5 boxes, which where each box is non empty. First, place one ball in each of the 5 boxes. So, Five box already fill up, so there are now becomes 15 for 15 options. Then we must count the number of ways of listing between it, the 15 remaining balls into five boxes. 
put unlimited iterations. So five boxes and 15 balls. Since five boxes already are there, so we write it c5 comma c5 minus 1 plus 15 comma 15. That is x1 plus x2 plus dot dot x5 plus 20. After distributing one ball into each of the five box, we then enumerating the number of integral solutions of y1 plus y2 plus dot dot y5 equal to 15. That is y greater than equal to This is the formula and this is the answer. If you like this video, then kindly subscribe and you just watching my videos and attach with my attach with me for more videos. Thank you for all.